It's like that movie Final Destination. You don't want this 2x4 flying off and then just like, Slaw! Impaled! Ah! Welcome to the Green Dream Project. Jim here. How's it going, everyone? Work continues here on the off-grid homestead. This happened today. Got my first rafter up today. I know, seems like it's taking forever. It was kind of a windy day, so it's kind of a late start before I got up there. I tried getting some of these two by fours up there and they're just flying around, that's no good. You don't want, you don't want those flying around. It's like that movie, uh, uh, Final Destination. It's like that movie Final Destination. You don't want this 2x4 flying off and then just like, Slaw! Impaled! Ah! Okay. Now that I got my first rafter in place, I'm gonna keep going down the line at two foot intervals. Two foot on center. This could take a while. Let me bring you back when I'm done marking these out. I said I was gonna bring you back when I'm done marking out those boards, but it's the next day and I'm still working on marking out those boards. <laughs> I was actually doing that late into the evening and then and then it just got too dark. I was, it was, there was a little bit of light and I could kind of see the marks, but as soon as my hand got close to mark it, the, the shadow of my hand just blotted out the mark and I, I, I couldn't have that. <laughs> <laughs> but it's actually kind of chilly here this morning, a little bit cloudy. I'm actually out here in a sweat, I got three layers on, sweatshirt, t-shirt, and then a sleeveless shirt. And I guarantee you as the day goes, like an hour or two, the sweatshirt's coming off, and then probably the t-shirt's coming off, and then I'll be working bare sleeve again. I just got maybe a little, about 30 more feet to mark. Take me a few minutes, then we'll get right back to the work. Oh yeah. All marked up, let's get these rafters up. Yeah. Time for the morning walk. Yeah. I thought for sure I'd have a big bruise on my knee this morning. Oh, <laughs> their, uh, their heads are harder than a human's. Ow! Oh, it hurt for like a good 15 minutes. Like, you know, flashing lights type of pain. Just ran straight in there, huh? <laughs> so when putting up my rafter, I'll be using these Simpson Strong Ties. I use these on the Hacienda. These have been working out really well. It's gonna make this thing real tight, real tight and sturdy up there. What's this? You think you can just do work on the homestead without uh, getting it on film? You trying to? Uh, Guess not. You trying to sneak things past the the viewers? They're gonna know it eventually. What you up? What are you up to with this hole? Making a garden. Making a garden. This don't look like no garden I ever seen. Special garden. <laughs> Why are you digging? Uh, like get that camera out of my face. <laughs> need to set some posts and bury some hardware cloth. It's busy yesterday. Fortunately, I ran into a little bit of downtime, maybe about four hours. That's a shame when that happens. But I did get nine of them up. But I'm up, back at it again. But we're gonna try and get as much done today as possible. We got a couple of engagements we got to attend to later today, but 
The work continues. We're going to see what we can get done. Come along. Fresh cow manure. Oh, yeah. did you get You're to try it. the outdoor shower? <laughs> you are not going inside. You here with me? He's like, I need to go in there. Because he's worried about the peanut butter Cheerios. <laughs> Is he concerned about that? Yes, because at the end, if there's a peanut butter Cheerios left over, they get that. So today, surprise, you get in the bag. So one thing that's been slowing me down is just I put a height difference on these two boards going across. Really the slope of this roof is so slight that it really doesn't need that, uh, that height difference and when there is even just a slight height difference between those two boards it's really throwing off the slope. So I've been lowering one side of the board just down just a hair to create that angle slope that I need. warm one today probably close to 90 degrees I'm loving it <laughs> it's hot it's hot working out here like that but prefer that over the cold take it any day feel the energy just got to drink a little extra water that's all five bays almost done six more to go getting there I'm feeling it I'm feeling it it's a magnificent sight already you see that I'm gonna keep working Keep attaching these rafters. I got a lot more to go. All right, there I am. <laughs> I haven't done video by lantern light in a while. Well, I was gonna try and film an ending to this video, but I let time get away from me. I've just been focused on getting these things up. <laughs> <laughs> so here I am, working and filming by lantern light. Sometimes that's the way you gotta do it. At the time of this filming, I am about halfway, just a little over halfway done with all these rafters. Five more bays to go, I've finished six, by five more bays to go, and we'll be done with this portion. <laughs> it's a project, all right. Thanks a lot everyone for joining me. Give this video, video a big thumbs up. For working in the lantern light if you haven't subscribed please do i don't always film this way we'd like to keep you around don't let this whole thing scare you <laughs> oh bugs all right share this with a friend or two we'd appreciate it and as always you can follow us on facebook instagram and twitter we'll catch you on the next video everyone bye <laughs>